How you guys doing? Uh, we're here at the Zojo G um, Buddhist Temple here, and I think on the back side we got the Tokyo Tower. So we got modern, and then we got old. So we're gonna go see what's on the other side, and hopefully we can, you know, see if we can find some UFC fans. I think I'm gonna get me a mask to be authentic here in Japan. I heard there's several reasons why people uh, wear the, the medical mask, because they all want to be doctors. Try to open it. Uh, be modest and faithful. It's better not to take the lead in doing anything. This is totally goes against me. An ill-minded person may cause you some trouble. Be careful of your company. Ooh. I think they're talking about my wife. Missing things? It's difficult to find. Duh, that's why it's missing. You see why I have two rings? It's because um, I visit. I went to visit my uh, wife's mother. So my mother-in-law. And went to train and did jiu-jitsu about a year, year and a half ago in Hawaii. And I ended up uh, losing my uh, wedding ring, or at least I, I thought I put it in the jiu-jitsu gym, and you know, uh, there was there were some people that I thought might have took it afterwards, but wasn't sure. And then probably about a couple, you know, went home, uh, ended up buying another wedding ring. Uh, and then we just got back from Hawaii. Uh, two weeks ago, and uh, my mother-in-law got in a car accident and ended up, like, when they were re -fi -fi finishing the uh, door, they pulled the door off, and the wedding ring was inside the door jam. And so, that's the reason why I have two wedding rings, because she found it. And last time I was here in Japan, me and my wife went to Baskin Robbins. Yes, they have Baskin Robbins here. I went, and I'm not a big fan of dessert, but my wife really wanted some ice cream. So she wanted three scoops, and the Japanese lady said, no, one scoop for you, three too much. <laughs> and I got three scoops, she only got one scoop, and that's why everybody's so skinny and small here. <laughs> well, now we're going to eat. Uh, it's been a little, you know, we're in Japan, so they're going to surprise me with some Japanese delicacy. Um, so it's supposed to be a fantastic spread. And I'm just hopefully I can fit through the door. Like what I know of the blowfish, it's the one that it's like a regular fish, and then when it when it feels like it's um, getting attacked, it blows up to a big fish. It got these spikes on it, and then it, uh, if you touch the spikes, they're very poisonous. And apparently, um, in Japan. They like to live on the edge. I like to fight, but they like to live on the edge, so they decide to cut open the, the fish and decide to eat it. And apparently if you cut it up wrong, the poison gets in the fish, and then you can pretty much die. So take special chefs, and so they're like martial artists when it comes to that, that they have to learn this, this, this art of how to cut the fish and dissect it and so we can eat it and not die. Eating blowfish is definitely going to be an experience. And I was trying to ride bikes earlier today and they told me that was dangerous, but they want to give me some poison, so it doesn't make any sense. It's like jello. It's, not, it, it's a weird looking jello shot. But I don't know if it's the jelly shaking or me. <laughs> Do I want the other one? It's definitely different. Tastes like jello. <laughs> Egg. Peso. Peso. Hi. What is that? Testicles. <laughs> really? Yeah. Very. 
Supposedly this is uh, testicles of the blowfish. But I've never seen a blowfish with balls hanging from it, so. Tastes like pork and beans. Let's put a little of that on there. Oh. Do I dip it in the sauce too? Are you sure? You sure the sauce is okay? Yeah, the sauce is okay. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> Can't wait to have that on Thanksgiving dinner again. <sighs> you know what? Blowfish is definitely interesting, but it's not that bad. And I'm still alive, so that's always a good thing. <laughs> the one thing about uh, coming to Japan that I've always wanted to do, uh, especially with the UFC, you know, covering the, you know, covering the bill, is I get to meet Godzilla. And um, I'm just, we're in Tokyo, so I want to make sure I meet Godzilla before we leave. <sighs> just want to say thanks for following me today. Uh, we're going to bed. Make sure you watch UFC 144, because I'm going to do it as soon as I wake up. See you tomorrow.